Hello everyone, I'm Josh from the Shamrock Stream and welcome back to Bernie Holowicki Court here at Detroit Catholic Central High School in Novi, Michigan where the Shamrocks will host the Eaglets of Orchard Lake St. Mary's. The Shamrocks enter having won five straight at a record of eight and one while the Eaglets have won two straight and hold a modest two and two record. Starting for the Shamrocks is number one, Colin Farrick, number two, Julian Menser, number four, Joe Bryson, number 12, Christian Manjo, number 15, Stone Chaney. And for the Eaglets, we got number 20, Norman Clawinder Jr. There's number 22, Cole Plagans. There's number 15, Reed McNutt. And we're underway here. There's a quick give and go. And there's Josh Janda with the finish as the Eaglets go up two to nothing here. Colin Farrick bringing the ball up the court. There's Christian Manjo with it. Back to Farrick. Down low. Four footer, no good. Cheney gets the rebound and it is stolen by Bryson. Quick back and it's stolen by the Eaglets. And there's a foul called on Joe Bryson, his first. Taking it from underneath the basket now are the Eaglets. There's another quick finish, and the Eaglets are up 4-0. That's Norman Clawinder Jr. with his first bucket. Eaglets lead 4-0. Manjo into the post at Stone Chaney, and there's a foul on 25. That's Gabriel Thayer, his first foul. To inbound is Manjo. Chaney on the low block. He's fouled. One's on Josh Janda, his first. Cheney's first is no good. Cheney dribbles three times, spins the ball in his hand. Second one is good. Shamrocks are on the board. And that one's stolen by Christian Manjo. Loose ball, but it is gathered by the Shamrocks. Up to Joe Bryson now. He drives into the lane, kicks to Chaney. With the finish, Stone Chaney on the assist by Joe Bryson. Eaglet's having trouble breaking this, but now it's up, it's stolen. Knocked out of bounds by Christian Manjo. Great hustle play there by number 12. Plagans to inbound, and that one's knocked out of bounds. Good defense by Cheney on the inbound. Eaglets lead four to three with six and 51 to play here in the first quarter. Plagans to inbound again. Not a lot of room. This one is into Gabriel Thayer. There's Jonda with it, guarded by Cheney. They get it back up top to Cole Plagans. Manjo is on him, and we have a offensive foul here on Gabriel Thayer, his second foul already. Bryson inbounds to Manjo. Seen a recurring theme here with full court back press on the point man as Stone Chaney holds it in the post. That's out to Colin Farrick now. Draws a defender, now to Bryson, now to Menzer. Menzer gonna take a deep three, that's no good. Rebound, Farrick, no good. Chaney rebound, no good. Some missed opportunities there as this ball is thrown way down to the other end of the corner. And the Eagles have possession. That's Josh Jonda with it. Now to Cole Plagans. Back to the corner and into the post, there is 
A good move by Gabriel Thayer. He's on the board with two points. Eagles lead six to three. Christian Manjo at the top. Drives into the lane. Kick out to Julian Menser. Screen up top by Cheney. Menser kicks to Farrick. Nothing doing here for the Shamrocks on this possession. They reset it at the top. Manjo to the corner. To Bryson. Back to Manjo. And they continue to work the zone defense. Here's an open three. Joe Bryson. He gets it to go. Joe Bryson ties the game up at six. And knocked out of bounds by Bryson. And coming in for Bryson now is number 21, Bryce Porter. The Eagles break the press, and it's off to the races. Uh, easy lay and missed, and the rebound goes to Stone Chaney. They move it up. Here's Manjo, sets for a three, air ball, and it's out of bounds. Eaglets inbound. Bringing it up, Norman Clawender Jr. Back to Jonda at the half court mark. Jonda drops it down. And a foul called on Christian Manjo, his first. Good bounce play. Clamped up at the top. There's a three by Plagans. It's good. Cole Plagans drills a three. And the Eagles take a 9-6 lead. Here's Christian Manjo. Doesn't go. Chaney with the rebound. And a strong putback by Stone Chaney. He's got five points already. Jonda inbounds it now. Clawender Jr. and a foul called on Colin Farrick. His first foul. Jonda inbounds it. Screen, and they get it in. Finishes too hard off the glass, but an offensive rebound. The Eagles get a second chance. There's Jonda, no good. Rebound, Stone Chaney. Christian Manjo. Julian Menser has the ball now. Stone Chaney back to Farrick. Bryce Porter now has it on the right wing. Manjo back up top. Shamrock's trying to run some screens to get someone open. Chaney's forced to pick his dribble up. Back to Menser. Great defense by the Eagles on this possession. Farrick gets it into Chaney. And he puts his head down, and we have a blocking foul here called on Josh Jonda. His second foul, he'll go to the bench. And also checking in for the Eaglets is number 14, Jacob Dallo. And number 10, Jonathan Kassab. As that inbounds pass is stolen. And we have a foul called on Stone Chaney, his first. The Eaglets hold a 9-8 lead here with 3-14 and 14 to play in the first quarter. The Eaglets to inbound. That's Norman Clawender in the corner. Back out to Kassab. Menser's on him. Picks up his dribble into the post. 
Nothing doing for Thayer, and now a uh, reach-in foul. That's called on Bryce Porter, his first foul. Five team fouls on the Sham Shamrocks already. And Sam Howard now checks in for Menser for the Shamrocks. He's on Kassab. Nice little give and go action. Clawender throws it. It's tipped out of bounds by Manjo. Sam Howard with some good defense on Jonathan Kassab. And that's knocked out. But we have a foul. Howard is called for the foul. A little bit iffy on the hands there. Jack Bardis with the inbounds pass here. And back out to Jack Bardis. Here's Gabriel Thayer posting up on Bryce Porter. Tries to swim around, but we have a travel. Mary's fourth turnover of the game today. Joe Bryson gets it into Christian Manjo and the Shamrocks. Move the ball quickly. Here's Manjo going all the way. Dips it to Bryce Porter off the glass. No. And a rebound to Gabriel Thayer. And Jonathan Kassab brings the ball up the court. Screen there by Thayer, and Kassab falls over. Gets it over to Clawender. Great defense by the Shamrocks, and we have a foul called here. Bryce Porter has two. He will go to the bench. And Stone Chaney comes back in, still leading the Shamrocks with five points. The Eaglets have already entered the bonus. That's the seventh team foul on the Shamrocks here. So Gabriel Thayer will go to the line for some one and one. Thayer's first is on its way. No good. Chaney with the rebound. He's got five. Up to Colin Farrick now. And we have a foul on Norman Clawender. And Josh McKee now checks in for the Shamrocks. Out goes Colin Farrick. Manjo to McKee on the right side. Manjo, Howard, Bryson from the corner, no. Offensive rebound, good battle down low by McKee, but he is out of bounds. Good box out, good rebound. The third turnover by the Shamrocks here in the first quarter. Bringing the ball up the court, Jacob Dallow stolen away by Joe Bryson. And an easy lay in for Joe Bryson. He's got five points now. The Eaglets are off to the races, nope. We've got to travel. So they reset and the Shamrocks will bring the ball up the court now. Christian Manjo has it. Howard takes a three. Good! Sam Howard for three. But the Shamrocks fail to get back on defense, and that leads to an easy lay-in for Jack Bartis. And a timeout here.
All right, we're back from the timeout as we resume play here. Shamrocks to inbound from their home side. It's Christian Manjo. Sam Howard has it. Back to Manjo, who stands on the Shamrock logo. Joe Bryson holds the ball now. There's McKee. Drives in with the left hand. Off the rim, no. Rebound comes out to Jonathan Kassab. Eagles trying to get something going. Kassab in the corner. Back out to Dalo. Pass fake from Gavin Mazzola. Jonda for three, no good. Kassab rebound off his hand. But the Eaglets retain possession. There's Josh Jonda with it in the corner. Over to Kassab. Jonda in the post, guarded by Chaney. Drives with the left hand off the glass. No good, rebound Christian Manjo. And off to the races here, Manjo, off the glass, no travel. Well, seen a lot of turnovers so far here in the first quarter. Seven seconds to play in the first. And a poor choice on the inbound as we have a loose ball. Howard dives on top of it, out to Bryson, clock at two, clock at one, no good. But a great quarter nonetheless for the Shamrocks as they lead 13 to 11 here when we come back the second quarter. Well, we're back for the next eight minutes of action here as the second quarter is about underway for the Shamrocks. It's Bryson, Whitmer, Stone Chaney, Christian Manjo, and Julian Menser. Bryson will inbound at half court. And the Shamrocks start their offense. Manjo dribbling from the top into the lane. Nice move, doesn't go. Rebound to Jack Bartis. And here comes Cole Plagans. Plagans has it on the edge. He's got six points. It's stolen by Manjo. There he goes. An easy land for Christian Manjo on an easy steal. He's on the board tonight. Shamrocks keep their press. It's broken well, though. There's Plagans with the kick out to the corner and back out to Dalo. Plagans gets the ball back. There's Jack Bartis, corner for Dalo for three, long, Menser rebound. Down come the Shamrocks, River Whitmer with it. Kick to the corner, Joe Bryson drives in. And we're gonna have a blocking foul here called on Jack Bartis. Checking in. For the Eaglets is Robert Hoffman. Whitmire to inbound it. Deep in the backcourt, Manjo kicks to Joe Bryson. Bryson drives with the right, gets past the defender, and a huge block by Jack Bartis. 
I don't know about that one, but impressive defense there. Whitmer to inbound. There's Cheney. Good. Cheney extends the Shamrocks lead to six. He's got seven points. Mentor hits the deck. Here's Hoffman. A lot of trouble. Cheney diving for the loose ball. That's off his leg, though. And this will go to the Eaglets. Into Cole Plagans. Julian Menser close guarding him. Plagans takes off. Now they reset a screen by Josh Jonda. Kick out pass. Oh, he forgot the ball. There's Joe Bryson on top of it. We're going to have a jump ball. Way to go in favor of the Eaglets, and the possession arrow will turn over. And Gabriel Thayer checks back in for St. Mary's. Josh Janda will be the inbounder. Robert Hoffman with it. Back to Janda. Joe Bryson's on him. To the corner. Nothing doing. Into Thayer. Stone Chaney puts his hand straight up. Great defense by Stone Chaney to get the missed shot. And here come the Shamrocks led by Manjo. There's Joe Bryson for three. Good! Joe Bryson for three. Great defense, Bryson with the steal. Here come the Shamrocks again. Manjo in transition, spin move, no foul. And this one's going to St. Mary's. Has some frustration by the Shamrocks now. Perhaps a missed call. Plagans trying to get around Bryson and does. Goes right down the lane. Kick out for three. Long. Cheney with another rebound. His seventh. Joe Bryson. Shot fake. Back to River Whitmer. And Bryson has it. Back to Whitmer on the logo. Whitmer being closely guarded by Robert Hoffman. Into Cheney. Drives in, pulls it back. There's Bryson, he drives in. Floater is good by Joe Bryson. He's got 10 points, the Shamrock's leading scorer. Josh Jonda trying to bring it up. Back to Cole Plagans. Menser's on him, he keeps getting beat. Menser reaching for that ball, but here's Josh Jonda. Drives in, foul call, that's on Joe Bryson. That's his second foul. And Janda will go to the line. First one, up and away, good. Janda's first points since the opening seconds. Bryce Porter now in for Cheney. Second one. On the way, off the rim and in. And Colin Farrick checks in for Manjo. Shamrocks lead 22 to 13 with 4 and 35 in the second quarter. So now it's Colin Farrick bringing it up for the Shamrocks. Give and go, Farrick into the lane. Easy finish by Colin Farrick. He's on the board for two. And a poor throwaway pass. A bad turnover. St. Mary's seventh turnover here. That's Josh Simpson. Or pardon me, that's Ben White with the throw away there. Colin Farrick being guarded closely by Ashton Shimami. 
Bryson in the corner, out to Whitmer. Whitmer drives, draws the defender, kicks to Menser, back to Farrick. Screen coming high from Porter. Farrick off the glass and too long. Bryson rebound, gets another rebound, and doesn't go. So instead it's Shamami with the rebound. And out of control, Whitmer with the steal. Off to the races, Whitmer. Puts it up, it's good. River Whitmer's on the board for two. Plagans caught off by Menser. We're gonna have a, nope. Great defense by Menser there. Forcing the turnover. And we'll go the other way. Oh, stolen here by St. Mary's. That's Shimami. And we have a foul called. And I think it was Bryson, which if it's Bryson, that's his third foul. So he heads to the bench. Stone Cheney checks back in for Porter, and McKee comes in for Bryson, with Manjo returning in for Farrick. Shimami from the line here, his first free throws of the night. First one is no good, and only one. Good rebound by McKee. McKee for three. No good, Whitmer pulls it down, and we have a foul here. Called on Josh Chanda. Whitmer will go to the line for one and one. Whitmer, no good. Rebound to Shimami. Ben White kicks to Shimami in the corner now. That is Kasab driving, kicking out to Shimami. Oh, that's going to be a travel. The ninth turnover by St. Mary's here in the first half. Sam Howard back in for the Shamrocks, who lead 26 to 13. Manjo has the ball at the top. Now it's River Whitmer. Back to McKee. There's Sam Howard. Drives to the lane, no good. Gets his own rebound, but he was on the line. They turn it over to St. Mary's. Ben White will inbound. And that is off the fingertip of Jonathan Kassab and another turnover, number 10 for Orchard Lake St. Mary's. McKee to Manjo. Into Cheney now. Cheney gets it into Manjo, a little late there on the pass. There's Howard for three, too long. Rebound by Gabriel Thayer and we have a foul called on Stone Cheney. His second foul. It's the tenth foul on the Shamrocks. So we'll get two shots here from Gabriel Thayer. Thayer's shot is no good. Nope. The Eaglets have struggled from the line going just two for six in this one with Jonna making both of those two. Thayer again 
no good. Short, rebound, no good. Rebound, no good. It's a tough stretch there by the Eaglets. Manjo to Whitmer. These two played together in middle school at Our Lady of Victory. Josh McKee now with it. And back up top to Manjo. He's guarded closely by Shamami. Porter with the screen. Manjo, 18-foot jump shot is long, and it's out of bounds. We have a substitution now. As Josh Simpson checks in. They're trying desperately to break this press. Taken away by Whitmer. McKee is blocked, no foul call. And down to the other end. Well. Seeing more and more how much of a difference this press makes. As that one's nearly taken away by Manjo. The Eagles get it back. Here's Simpson driving to the lane. A foul is called. That's a little early. That's on River Whitmer, though. Only his first. The struggling Eaglets return to the line. Simpson, no good. We eliminate the turnovers, you eliminate the missed free throws. This could be a much closer game as the second one by Simpson is good. They needed that one. Christian Manjo to bring the ball up for the Shamrocks. Bryce Porter has it at the top. Whitmer thought about taking a three, does it. Now we have Sam Howard covered closely by Jonathan Kassab. Christian Manjo on the logo. Gets it into Porter at the high post. Drives in on Thayer. Tough pass across the paint. It's tied up by Josh Simpson. He tried to get it to River Whitmer. Possession arrow will turn over, but this one will stay with the Shamrocks. As Whitmer kicks McKee. Some fresh passes. That one's too hard for Porter to handle. Thayer kicks it to Kassab. That one's taken straight away by River Whitmer. And we go into the fast break now. Gets it up to Howard. Can't finish. Tough layup. But not going to get a better look than that. We're in our final 50 seconds of the first half with the Shamrocks holding a 26 to 14 lead. There's Manjo to inbound. Goes deep to McKee. And now to Whitmer. Simpson's guarding him. Here's into McKee. He's got Jack Bardis on him. Back to Whitmer, 18 footer long and it Bounces off the backboard. Now the Eaglets, good bounce pass and a good finish by Norman Clawender Jr. Here come the Shamrocks. Christian Manjo holds it on the logo. They're gonna get the final shot here as we're under 12 ticks to play in the first half. Screen from Porter. Into Porter now. And that is gonna be a travel. A wasted possession to end the half for the Shamrocks. Maybe they can get a steal here on this press though. Bardis tries to send a long pass. Caught and a foul is called on Bryce Porter. His third foul. Going to the line for the Eaglets. Norman Clawender Jr. with four points today. That's good.
Second one on its way. It's good as well. Quick pass, Manjo from just over half court. It's short. Well, the Shamrocks lead the Orchard Lake St. Mary's Eagle. It's 26 to 18 at the half for the Shamrocks. Joe Bryson leads the team with 10 points. And for the Eaglets, Norman Clowender Jr. with five points. We'll have a 10 and a half time, and when we come back, the start of the third quarter here in Novi.
Welcome back. Welcome back to Novi. Just about 40 seconds until we'll start this second half. Shamrocks lead the Eagles 26 to 18 behind Joe Bryson's 10 first half points. Another notable player in the first half, Stone Chaney with seven points and seven rebounds. Spartans big or the Shamrocks bigs have worked themselves into a little bit of foul trouble. Porter with three and Chaney with two. Bryson also has three, but he's out there to inbound to start the second half. All right, we've swapped swap, swap sides, and Joe Bryson inbounds to Christian Manjo. There's Farrick, Joe Bryson off the rim. We got a foul called here. It's on Jack Bardis, his second. And we're going to have two free throws coming up for Joe Bryson. Bryson's first is good. Second one from the St. Edith graduate is good. 12 points now for Joe. Shamrocks still with that press. Jack Bardis races to the ball to inbound. Going long for Gabriel Thayer. One on one with Cheney. Puts that second foot down, no travel called. It's taken away by Stone Cheney. Up to Manjo. And one. Christian Manjo. Manjo has the three-point play. Bardis to inbound again on the press. That's in to Kasab, and it's swatted away by Manjo. Excellent defense from the Shamrocks. New inbounder is Norman Clawender, Jr., the Eagles' leading scorer. Great sideline defense by Manjo, swatted out of bounds by Joe Bryson. Excellent defense by the Shamrocks here. Bardis guarded by Bryson to inbound. Kasab with it, Manjo slaps the ball, knocks it down. Kasab in trouble, picks up his dribble. There's Gabriel Thayer with it at the three point arc. That one's taken away by Joe Bryson. Bad pass by Josh Simpson. Bryson in the lane. He's fouled. He'll get two more shots. The foul is called on Jack Bardis. Another one. He's got three. Bryson's first free throw is good. Bryson to extend the 32-18 Shamrocks lead. Second one is good. All right, Glomander standing on the O of the Shamrocks. Up ahead, and oh, Cheney just getting really good at just poking that ball free. That one's knocked out of bounds. The Eaglets retain possession.
Kasab gets it in. Step over three for Plagans is short. And the rebound to Joe Bryson. Up ahead, that's Colin Farrick. Kicks it to Julian Menser. Guarded by Cole Plagans. Stone Chaney has it now. Over, Bryson thought about it, but resets it out to Colin Farrick. And they reverse the ball to Manjo and to Menser in the corner. Chaney trying to post up on Gabriel Thayer. Gets the ball, no foul. Taken away by Thayer. On the other end, here's Cole Plagans. Open is Kassab. Tries to draw Farrick offsides and driving to the lane. Manjo, easy takeaway for him as he spins down. Bryson, three ball. Good! Joe Bryson again! 17 points for number four. But he gets beat here. Thayer laying no good. Bryson with the rebound. And here's Christian Manjo driving the defense. Menser, deep three. Good! Julian Menser for three. And a timeout called by the Eaglets. The Shamrocks have taken a 39-18 lead with 5.45 in the third quarter. A 13-0 run to double their lead. Eaglets have not scored yet in this second half. All right, back from the Eaglets timeout. The Eaglets will get the ball at half court. Clawwinder's out there with Kassab, McNutt, and Jonda. And lastly, Cole Plagans for the Eaglets and for the Shamrocks. It's Menser, Manjo, Farrick, Cheney, and Joe Bryson. Plagans gets the inbound here, takes off, splits. Two defenders, but it's taken away by Christian Manjo. And an easy lay-in for him. He's not going to miss those. Seven points for Manjo and five steals as well. Now the Eaglets. Clawender fouled. That's Bryson. Well, Bryson has 17 points and five rebounds, but on the other end of the spectrum, he has three fouls. Clawender, good. He's got six points for the Eaglets today. And Joe, taken out. So now we have Clawender's second free throw, which is good. He extends to seven points now. Manjo draws the lane, no good. Chaney rebound and the putback is good. Stone Chaney with nine points and nine rebounds. Here come the Eaglets, taken away by Whitmer. Here he comes. And no one there to stop him, but he throws it too hard off the glass. And Plagans is shut down. Thayer, no good. Here comes Farrick, and Manjo's all alone with an easy finish. More fast break points for the Shamrocks today. And now the Eaglets. Oh, doesn't go. Push called on River Whitmer. 
That's his second foul. Eagles will take it out from the corner. But the Shamrocks have blown this game wide open now, leading 45-20 to 20 over St. Mary's. Dallo, no good. Manjo up to Julian Menser. Back to Manjo. Whitmer has an open three. No. Cheney just out muscles Gabriel Thayer, but now Josh Janda takes it away. Manjo takes it back. Christian Manjo once again making an excellent impact on the defensive side of the ball with nine points, but also six steals. As this turnover goes against Julian Menser. Cole Plagans will bring it up for the Eaglets. Drives in, kicks it out to the corner. Good move by Cloender Jr. He's got nine points. Whitmer to Farrick, back to Manjo. Menser back to Manjo. Drives in, no good, gets his own rebound, blocked. An excellent block by Jacob Dallo, but this is taken away by Colin Farrick. Farrick kicks, Menser for three, doesn't go. Cheney with his 11th rebound. You have a timeout. Stone Cheney hustling on the offensive boards tonight. All right, we have 316 to play here. Catholic Central leads Orchard Lake St. Mary's 45 to 22. Checking in for the Shamrocks is going to be Bryce Porter and Josh McKee. And for the Eaglets, Ashton Shimani's out there. McKee will inbound. Gets it into Manjo, who's guarded by Dallo. Menser has it on the C. Kicks to McKee, who's guarded by Jonda. Porter in the post. One dribble, kick to Farrick for three. Off the rim, no. A loose ball foul called there. On Jacob Dalla. that's his first foul. Entering the game. For the Eaglets now is Brandon Oro. First time he sees the floor tonight. Good pass fake off the inbound by McKee. Porter puts the shoulder in, drives, air ball. Jonda with the rebound. Plagans kicks it almost too high for Shamami who comes down with it. And Josh Janda driving in, no good. A tie-up under the basket between Gabe Thayer and Colin Farrick. Eaglets will retain possession. Cole Plagans will inbound for our Orchard Lake St. Mary's. Farrick with some aggressive defense there. Shamami able to handle it. And now Cole Plagans... Which is to the right side. Here is Josh Janda. It draws the foul. Foul is called on Josh McKee, his first. Janda will go to the line. He's two for two today from the line. He's got four points. Ah! 
No good on the first. The Eaglets are 7 of 14 today from the line as Joe Bryson checks back in. John the second one. Up and no good. Chasing the rebound is Ashton Shamami. Timeout called by the Eaglets here. With 2.25 to go, Jonna misses both of the two free throws there. Well, the defensive impact has certainly been real for the Shamrocks today. And it starts with Christian Manjo, leads a team with six steals. Next would be River Whitmer with four. Joe Bryson's got two, and Chaney's got one, along Farrick also has one. Standout defense on the press. Man, even on the other side of the ball, they're taking away the fast break opportunities from St. Mary's. Shamrocks come out of the timeout with the same five. And the same five for the Eaglets as well. Gabriel Thayer. Tipped away by Joe Bryson. Rather, I should say smacked away by Bryson. Thayer inbounds. Gets it in to Shimami. Throws it into the corner for Oro. Jonda guarded by Bryson. Another great defensive play by Joe Bryson. With 2 and 17 to play in the third quarter, the Shamrocks lead 45 to 22. We have a substitution. Plagans will come out. In comes Kasab. Jonda inbound. Here's Kasab with it. Drives on Manjo. We got a block called on Christian Manjo. Only. Well, that's his third, actually. Thayer drives in on Cheney. Post fade is no good. And here's Christian Manjo. Kicks to Menser in the corner. Out to Joe Bryson. He's guarded by Jonda. Menser has it up top. Brandon Oro follows him closely. There's a good pounce pass to McKee Manjo. Now Joe's the three after the foul is called. Foul is called on Ashton Shimami. That's his first. McKee, inbound. Chaney off the glass. So pretty. Stone Chaney has earned himself that double-double. 11 points and 12 rebounds for the big man. Ashton Shimami with it. Now is Jonda guarded by Joe Bryson. Good motion offense here. Shimami drives the lane. Too hard off the glass, but that one's knocked out by Stone Chaney. 47-22 lead for the Shamrocks. Checking in for the Eaglets, Gavin Mazzola. Here comes the inbound. Thayer, Shimami with it now. He gets it back down the corner to Kasab. Trying to shake Colin Farrick, following him like a hawk. Good pick set by Thayer. And we have a foul. On Stone Cheney, his third. Mazzola inbounds to Kasab. Stands at half court. Guarded closely by Farrick. 
Mazzola gets the ball now with Bryson on him. Nothing doing here. A lot of passes for St. Mary's. Kassab puts the ball down, drives, kick out pass to the corner, floaters, no good by Brandon Oro. And here comes Colin Farrick inside the Cheney. One dribble, puts the shoulder down and puts the ball in the basket. 13 points for Stone Cheney tonight. Second behind Joe Bryson. As going to the lane here, Oro way too long there. I mean, that's Kassab. Meanwhile, Farrick is fouled on the fast. Oh, turnover here. Jonathan Kassab bringing the ball up for St. Mary's. Shamami. There's a deep three by Thayer. Too hard. Rebound to Joe Bryson. And the last second chuck is no good. At the end of the third quarter, your Shamrocks lead St. Mary's 49 to 22. Welcome back for the start of fourth quarter action. CC leads OLSM 49 to 22. Fresh eight minutes on the clock and into the game. Ethan Godin is out there with Farrick, Sam Howard, Joe Bryson. And on a low post is Bryce Porter. Farrick. Gets the ball to Howard. Guarded closely by Patrick Kakos. As there's Farrick, draws a defender. Ethan Godin thought about taking the three, but instead gets it back out to Porter. Howard, Godin, shot fake. Tries to get it into Howard. Good pass, but it's knocked away. St. Mary's gains possession. The same point man bringing it up. Kassab for St. Mary's. St. Mary's has not made a field goal in the entirety of the second half. Norman Clowinder Jr. has all four points off of free throws. As here's Sam Howard, give and go to Farrick. Post shot, too long. And the rebound goes to Mazzola on the break. A little bit too long, so they have to bring it back out to Josh Janda. Janda, great defense by the big man Porter. Shot fake by Kakos, and Kassab has it. Pick set on Godin, drawing into the lane. Foul is called. Bryce Porter picks up his third foul. And checking in for the Shamrocks. River Whitmer and Adrian Gamgee as Joe Bryson heads to the bench, maybe for the final time today. Good screen set. And Gamgee's call for the foul upon entry. Jonathan Kassab will take two shots from the line.
That'll move the Eaglets into the bonus as Kasab's first free throw is good. His first point of the day. Second free throw by Kasab is on its way. That's good as well. Kasab makes both of them. River Whitmer brings it up for the Shamrocks. Into Porter. Give and go. Whitmer, nothing doing. Gom Jay with it. They reverse it to Godin and now to Howard. Howard getting it into Godin in the post is guarded by Gavin Mazzola. Little post move. Godin will get two shots here, fouled by Gavin Mazzola. His first. Godin misses the first. Well, the Shamrocks were 7-7 seven seven until that point from the line. They have to be pleased with how well they've been shooting from the charity stripe tonight. Second one also no good. Adrian Gamje hustles to get the rebound. And they get it back into Godin. Here's Gamje. Easy two. Adrian Gamje's on the board. With a great setup pass by Ethan Godin. Kasab has it for St. Mary's. Drives in and off the glass too hard for Hoffman. Whitmer gets the ball. Out past half court. Screen by Porter. Shut down here. Sam Howard drives in. Gives a good pass to Godin. Great pass by Sam Howard. Ethan Godin able to finish that for two. Shamrocks 53, the Eaglets 24. 5 and 12 to play in the fourth quarter. Taking it to the rack and way ahead is Kakos. As here comes River Whitmer. As there's a foul called. Going for the ball. That one's on Jonathan Kasab as he heads to the bench. As the Shamrocks are now in the bonus. River Whitmer will get one and one. As Porter checks out. In comes Stone Cheney. The unsung hustler from tonight's victory. Whitmer drills the first. Three points for him. He'll get one more. Head coach Ryan McGlinch continues to smile from the sideline as Whitmer misses the second. Godin trying to get a hustle play. Instead, it's Cheney who comes away with it. And no foul called there as they continue to go for the ball on the ground. Whitmer gets it. Shot is no good. Cheney with another rebound. And the putback by Stone Cheney. 15 points, 14 rebounds. The Eaglets still without a field goal in the second half. Jonda, great defense by Cheney. Drives in. That one doesn't go. Cheney with his 15th rebound. Pass up by Whitmer. Godin, too short. Rebound by Kakos. And there it is. That's the first field goal made in the second half. And it comes with 4.04. In the fourth quarter, Kakos scores his first two. Stone Chaney with it. Drives in. Blocked. Great block by Josh Jonda. He takes it himself. Euro step layup. Doesn't go. Ethan Godin with the rebound. Whitmer up to Gamje. And Jonda tips it back. And it's stolen by Gavin Mazzola. In the post now, that one rolls in for Josh Simpson. 
The Shamrocks 56, the Eaglets 28 with 3 and 21 to play in the fourth quarter. Stone Chaney has it just outside the free throw arc. There's Gamje. Bounce pass to Chaney. Right past him. Beautiful bounce pass by Gamje. Beautiful finish by Stone Chaney. Simpson gives it to Kakos. Draws the defender, which is Howard. There's a three long Chaney. Number 16 for him. As there's Gamje with it. Into Chaney again. Stone Chaney. Gamje picks up his third assist. Excellent ball movement as the Shamrocks have reached 60 points. We're going to get a timeout here by Orchard Lake St. Mary's. 60 to 28, a blowout lead for the Shamrocks in the closing minutes of this game. All right, Orchard Lake St. Mary's will have the ball from the sideline after the timeout. Julian Menser enters the game for the Shamrocks. Mazzola to inbound. Josh Simpson has it. Driving to the lane. Too long, rebound. Oh, Porter drops. Jack Bardis on the jump ball. Simpson will inbound. They reverse it out. Simpson back in the corner with it. Kakos drives to the lane. Shut down by Sam Howard. Menser nearly tips it. Porter, great defense. Gets a bad shot, force. Jack Bardis missed that. Menser from deep, drills it. No big deal for Julian Menser as he knocks down a deep three. Six points for him on two threes. A 35 point lead for the Shamrocks as Stone Chaney hits the bench for the final time today. McKee comes in for him. Bad pass thrown away there by Brandon Oro. One or two minutes to play. Sam Howard gets it and Menser straight down. He's gonna take another one from deep. That clinks off the front of the rim. Howard goes to chase the loose ball. But to turn it over to OSM. Simpson to bring the ball up again. Menser in his face. Tries to drive left. Badly missed there. Godin pulls it down. Final 80 seconds here for Catholic Central. Godin, shot fake. Got Bardis off his feet. Menser holds it. Simpson guarding him. Now it's Godin to Howard. McKee has it in the post. He's guarded by Mazzola. It's back out to Menser. Under a minute now. Simpson trying to get the ball from Menser. Leads with that elbow. Godin for three. Off the front, McKee with the rebound and the putback. Josh McKee's got his first two points today. He had four rebounds. 
Kakos driving straight to the rim. Misses an easy layup. Howard pulls it down. And we have a travel called on Adrian Gamje. Simpson has it. 16 seconds here at Bernie Holowicki Court. Kick out pass, there's Kakos for three, it's no good. Howard grabs the rebound, it's tipped out of bounds. And the Shamrocks retain possession with four seconds here to play. Menser will hold and dribble this ball out. A beautiful win, picture perfect. Spotless performance for the Catholic Central Shamrocks as they take down Orchard Lake St. Mary's 65 to 28. Tonight's player of the game would have to be Joe Bryson who scored 17 points, most of those coming in the first half, which gave the Shamrocks an early lead. But do not go without the unsung hero tonight, Stone Chaney, also 19 points and 16 rebounds. And also for the Shamrocks, Christian Manjo, nine points and six steals. The leading scorer for the St. Mary's Eaglets was Norman Clawinder Jr. with nine points, most coming off of free throws. This is Josh signing off for the Shamrock stream. And thank you for joining us, and we'll see you next time.